in our rain tonight. Samuel, come here. Listen. The guards, they're singing. Eh, well, they're probably drunk. Perhaps. But they are content. How can they be content with their small lives? Their miserable jobs? <laughs> well, I mean, they have wives to go home to. What do we got? Huh? No offense. We have ambition. No. <laughs> and when we get out of here, that ambition will take us to places these idiots cannot even imagine. Yeah, well, amen to your optimism. <sighs> what will you do when you get out, Samuel? <laughs> That's if I get out of here. I'm sure you can imagine. I can. But I want to hear you say it. I will find the greatest pirate treasure of all time. Which I am sure you are sick of hearing about by now. Oh, no. The tale of Henry Avery and his 400 million in jewels and gold has... become a sweet lullaby for me. Do you really think you can find it? Given the opportunity? Absolutely. Ambition. What is that Avery quote? <laughs> I am a man of fortune, and I must seek my fortune. I like how he thinks. What the hell was that? The opportunity of a lifetime. Señor Alcázar, un gusto verlo. Segmenta aquí. Oh. ¿Qué hacemos con él? Samuel, are you ready to seek your fortune? Yeah. Vámonos. Holy shit. Los demás están en posición. En camino. Todo va de acuerdo al plan, señor. Fantastic. How long have you had this plant? Since the moment I set foot in this place. Samuel, keep up. We're going to have to move quickly. Holy shit. Pedazo de mierda. Como la puerta. Nunca saldrás de aquí. Silencio. Jesus. These men are sadistic. We're doing the world a favor, huh? Here, you'll need this. You remember how to use it. Yeah, it'll come back to me. Abran todas las puertas. Hector, you do that, and you'll start a goddamn riot. <laughs> exactly. Háganlo. Stay close, Sammy. That's working. 
Yeah, I see. So now what? Estamos en posición. ¿Están listos? Sí. Busquen dónde cubrirse. Samuel, get behind something. What? Why? Just do it. Yeah. Yeah, I'm fine. Samuel, take cover. Samuel, in a minute, we will either be free or dead. Are you ready? Shit!
for Samuel Drake. Huh? Mm. Jesus, what is next? Uh, I'm gonna take a bath. I'm gonna sleep in a real bed. Mm. Maybe find a nice warm body to sleep next to me. Uh, track my brother down. Seems like a pretty good start. Uh, it is. So, uh, how long? Do you think it will take for you to retrieve Avery's treasure? Uh, I don't know. I mean, I, uh, I get back to the States, I can resume my search. How long? Uh, it's kind of hard to say until I get started. You said you know where it is. Yeah, uh, I do, okay? But listen, it's, it, it's not like Avery left some map with a big red X on it, okay? But I've, I've, I've got some very solid... Oh, okay. J just, just wait a minute. Take, take, take. Hey, take it easy. Uh, I like you, Samuel. More importantly, I believed you. That is why you were here. I can, I can get it. Okay, I, I just need some time. Tell me, Uncle Gio. You see, the problem is. I'm having all these doubts into my mind. Hector, listen to me. I will find it. I swear to you. How long? Six months. <laughs> People are lazy. They always ask for more time than they actually need. Three months. Three months is a bad. Three months. Half the treasure. Can you do it? Say it. Try to hide the treasure, or do something really stupid like go to the authorities. Oh no! And when you least expect it, I will be there. At that point, death is not a mercy I will grant you. Here, come on. No. The nearest town. It's ten kilometers in that direction towards the sunrise. <laughs> it's been a while since we've seen the sunrise outside, huh? Vamos. When I find it, then what? Don't worry. When the time comes, I'll be there to collect. When I swear this, Samuel. Uh, let's me go and here we are. This is bad. 
We just pick up the trail where we left off and... Wait, trail? Sam, there's no trail. After Rafe and I escaped, he took his parents' fortune and bought up all the land around St. Dismas Cathedral. We combed that place for weeks. Avery's treasure isn't there. Not that that stopped Rafe. The moron's been digging for years, still hasn't turned up squat. Not really surprised. What does that mean? Well, I just, you know, happened to do a little digging of my own. And, uh, I bet your Rafe doesn't have this. It's really amazing what you can find on the internet these days. It's just the St. Dismas Cross. Oh, is it? Because the one we found was broken and hollow, remember? Holy crap, it's still intact. Avery made more than one cross. So whatever was missing from the one in Panama is probably still inside this one. Mm -hmm. Well, all right. Well, where is this? Oh, this exquisite piece is going up for auction in three days at the Rossi Estate. The Rossi Estate? Well, you know it. Uh, yeah. And how do you plan on securing an invite to an exclusive, heavily guarded black market auction? Well, you don't necessarily need an invitation, per uh, se. Huh? Yeah. And uh, where are you going to get the money to outbid all the high rollers? I could take a second mortgage out on my house, and it still wouldn't be enough to... Yeah, you're going to try and steal it, huh? No. We are. Oh, no. No, man, listen, I'm, I can't. I'm, I'm out. What? No, I, I, I just don't do that kind of thing anymore. Besides, there, there are plenty of other guys that are much more equipped to handle this kind of thing. Like who? Um, I don't know, like, uh, Jeez. anybody, Charlie Cutter. No. You no, know, he's my no, go-to no, guy no, for this sort of thing. No, absolutely not. I don't trust Charlie or anybody else that you've got on that phone with my life, okay? I need you on this one. Sam, there's got to be another way. Not with the time I got left. Certainly not with Alcazar. Hey, hon, it's me. Yeah, uh, listen, you're not gonna believe this. Jameson just walked in here with the permits. Yeah. I know, I know, but uh, it's like I'm gonna take that Malaysia job after all. See anything yet? Just a bunch of high-class, low-life criminals all cleaned up for prom. <laughs> and no sign from Sullivan yet. Well, there's still plenty of time. Looks like the storage room's in the building behind the manor. You see it from up there? Just the very top of it. Oh, I wonder what... <laughs> Let's just focus on Avery's cross, okay? No, you sure you don't want to pick up something for the wife? It's cute. Let's keep it simple. Right, simple. <laughs> it would be a whole lot simpler if it was just the two of us. Sam. We could be inside already. Not cleanly. Have you even thought about a backup plan in case uh, Sullivan gets cold feet? No, because he won't. Or if he got caught? Sam, he knows the people running the auction. It's gonna schmooze his way right through that party, get upstairs, unlock the window, and we're in. It's a solid plan. Uh-huh. All right, fine. Good, say it. What if he stole the cross for himself? Not in a million years. Victor Sullivan. Say Victor we're talking about, right? Yes, he's double-crossed people in the past, but not us. No, not you. I know you two have never seen eye to eye. Huge understanding. But I trust him, all right? He's family. And... No, 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 no. I just need you to trust him, too. Fine. Fine. 
He'll come through for us. Eventually. But I mean, come on, you have to at least just for one second consider the possibility. There. See? Trust. Just try to keep your tux clean. Thanks. I can't believe I'm out. I can't believe I'm here you mean, with you in Italy, huh? <laughs> yeah, me either. Just wish the circumstances were less tense, you know? Eh, uh, well. Now the sights are a bit more enjoyable that way. Oh. Uh, <clears throat> so this, this isn't your first time here? No, it's more like uh, third. <laughs> Had a couple of odd jobs. With Sullivan? Well, yeah. <laughs> OK. Man, there's no way up under that bridge. Well, there's that exposed beam underneath. Hey, you think you can rope it? Do I think I can rope it? <laughs> Watch this. I'm watching. I, uh... I missed. Uh, see, it's uh, it's all in the wrist. Here, let me see it. Ah, see? Yeah, it's not bad. For a second attempt. Here we go. Uh. You see that? Oh, like a pro. It's your turn. <laughs> oh. So where to next? Hey, bet we can swing off that beam up there. Uh, definitely. Hey, let's switch places. All right, climb over me. I've, I've got a good grip. OK. <clears throat> OK, here we go. First try. All right, no one likes a show off. Okay, come on, Nathan. It looks like you can uh, climb down and make your way over. Right behind you. Okay. attraverso un tubo e forse non potrà più camminare. Ah, bene lì sta. Ehi, hey, è scommesso sulla partita. Inghilterra vince. Inghilterra, traditore. Ehi, hey, non confondere l'orgoglio nazionale con la realtà. Ok, we're good. Jesus, did you see him? That Renner thug was packing some serious heat. Should have brought guns. Sam, we're gonna pull this off so smoothly we won't need them. You're right. Ah, all those years. <laughs> it's the little things that you miss the most. Like what? The smell of fresh citrus. <laughs> uh, riding the motorcycle. It's little things, but... They add up. A 
There's our window. That should hold. Come on down. <clears throat> ah. <laughs> These landings are a little more painful than I remember. <clears throat> yeah, tell me about it. So, uh, your other wonderful finds, uh, the ones I missed, you at least take any pictures? I wish. Elena filmed some of it, but camera didn't make it. That's too bad. I have some drawings, though. When we get back, I can show you. You have drawings? What, are they up on the fridge or something? No, I, they're good drawings. I can't wait. Ah, this looks promising. I think you mean precarious. <laughs> Shit! You okay up there? <sighs> yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Suck if you missed right now. It sure would. <clears throat> but I don't miss. million bucks. Let's go. All right, I'm right behind you. Sully? You know what I love about partying with a bunch of crooks? What's that? Nobody cares if you smoke indoors. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a while. Too long, boy. Oh. <clears throat> you remember my dead brother, right? Victor? I'll be goddamned. Fifteen years. Yep. Good to see you alive, Sam. Mm -hmm. Let's uh, let's try keeping him alive by getting this cross, huh? Yeah. Uh, about that. What? What about that? Come on. Let me show you something. Take a look. That's Avery's cross. They brought it out of storage just before you guys got here. They changed the lot order. Take a whole pile of cash to make that happen. All right, well, how long before they start the bidding? 10, 15 minutes tops. Well, there's gotta be some way we can grab it. 
There is just a small matter of a few hundred eyewitnesses okay, down there. Okay, okay, but we just need a diversion. Like? Like, um... Like, I don't know. But there's gotta be something. Well, if the guards see us <laughs> making for that cross... But they don't see us. Hmm? Jesus, you guys act like you never spend time in prison. If you want something dirty done, then you wait for, for lights, lights out. out. Yeah. Where's that electrical panel for this place? There's ventilation. Electrical? That's it up here. So we just have to climb up there and kill the lights. Grab the cross in the dark. There will be an emergency generator. And that'll give us a few seconds of darkness to work with. Meaning we'll have to be right next to the cross when the lights go out. So there's no way we can get that close without being noticed. Scusate, signora. <clears throat> Antipasti? Mosa. Hi. How are you? Ciao. Would you focus? The waiter wouldn't get noticed. That could work. Uh -huh. That will work. <laughs> All right. All right, I'll, I'll get to the breaker room and kill the power. You mean I'm the waiter? You're the best pickpocket. What? You head down to the floor, keep your eye on the prize, okay? Let us know if anything uh, hinky goes down. Roger that. All right. Listen, we still got this. Ready? Ready. All right. Follow me. We'll cut through the cellar. I gotta say, Victor, the years have been kind to you. Thanks. I chuckled at you. Don't be. Really? <laughs> Are you kidding me? Hell no. I refuse to be. What are you doing? I'm just going over our exit strategy. It's gonna get hairy. <laughs> Look, relax. We pulled off tougher heist than this. Yeah, I know, I know. I just try not to imagine what they'll do if they catch us. Sam, if things go bad, we'll be dead long before they catch us. That's a comforting point. Yeah. I had a reasonable grasp of French, or at least a passable French accent. But then a few months back, I'm with my girlfriend by the Pompidou Center. I've just sold them those pieces we... Cellar's just through there. Let's go. Well, this place is fancy. Of course they play douchey European techno. Monsieur Lanza, do you remember this? Here we are. All right, let's do this. Oh, hell, it's locked. Shit, it was open earlier. Now what? Can we pick it? No, it's electronic. We're gonna have to find another way in. at work. Okay. All right. Let's try this again. We'll still need these. Great. Good luck. 
We'll be in touch. Hands in the air. Hi, Victor. Hello, Nadine. <laughs> Pleasure to see you again. Only this time, I've got the drop on you. Well, I guess I should be glad that's not a real gun. <laughs> Hardly recognize you out of your fatigues. Yeah. You know how it is. Every once in a while, a job requires us to get all dolled up. Looking sharp, by the way. Not too bad yourself. Feels so out of place here. Can't tell you what a relief it is to run into another English speaker. Even if you are American. They'll have to blame my parents for that one. <laughs> I was on my way to the bar. Can I get you something? Yeah, scotch. On the rocks. Be right back. Date? You catch all that? Yes, I did. Sounds like a lady's trying to buy you a drink. Yeah, Nadine Ross is buying me a drink. Nadine Ross? Wait, doesn't she own that army for hire? Is it called Coastline? Shoreline. Yeah. Right. But you had a run in with them. It's putting it mildly. Fortunately, she does not seem to be holding a grudge. I'm good to go here. All right. Listen, we're all set, Sully. You uh stay out of trouble, okay? I'll try. You ready? <laughs> yeah, let's do it. Yeah, find where the waiters and caterers are hanging. The kitchen, probably. Then let's go find the kitchen. Man. There's enough food down here to feed a small town. Crap. You see a waiter in there? Nah, just more heavily armed goons. is this? This gate wasn't on the blueprint. <clears throat> Locked, of course. Okay, plan B. up there. Nathan, come check this out. Here we go. Let there be light. I'd like to go in this joint. <sighs> Don't suppose you brought a... F yeah, that'll do. Guess it's always a good idea to bring a smoker along. Unless you need to run. Oof. Man, I'm starting to get a little drunk off the fumes in here. Oh, good thing Sully's driving. The vent access is behind these casks. That's a lot of really rare vintage. Yeah, maybe Alcazar can just settle for some good wine. <laughs> that's something tells me that's not gonna fly. Hey, uh, she'll be worried that Victor is chatting up Nadine Ross. I mean, I've heard some pretty scary stories about her crew. Yeah, don't worry about Sully. I can talk his way out of anything. <laughs> hey, 
There you go. This way. Hey, look, the vents. That's our way out. Yep. Let's find something to climb on. Yeah, I got it. No need to give me a hand or anything. I'm holding a lighter. Holding a lighter. Okay, up we go. Right there. That's smaller than it looked, huh? <laughs> and a lot more dusty. Shh, shh, shh. Damn it. looks like my size, too. There's no shortage of waiters around here. Si procurano tutta questa roba. Sono pezzi rubati ai ricettatori. Fresh air, here we come. Hey, check this out. See that building with the radio tower? You mean the cell tower? The what? Whatever. Listen, that's the power room. Yeah, you're right. Let's see how we get past this gate. Sam, up here. I'll boost you up. All right. Thing you kept in shape. There you go. Sully, we just got out of the wine cellar, heading to the power room now. How's it looking? Sully? You there? Ah, it must be a bad spot for a signal. Hopefully he's doing okay. Bingo. Found the kitchen. And, of course, it's locked. Sam, look. Maybe we can use that and find a window. Drop into the kitchen. That's a good idea. I'll boost you. Got it? Heads up, heads up! Sera. Ma che sta facendo? Easy on the civilians, Sam. All right. So he wakes up with a headache in his underwear. We've both been there before, right? <laughs> right. Well, I got mine. You get yours. All right. Okay, let's get to the power room. Sam, you good? Yeah, these pants are just a little bit too tight. Yeah, well, that's the style these days. Really? Oh, we're in Rome. Nah, because we're in Italy. I get it. All right, I'm going to head back to the <laughs> <laughs> 
Sam, you there? <clears throat> Sam? Sully? Great. Guys, if you can hear me, I'm just about at the power room. Should be there soon. Ish. believe you got away with that. Oh, we did not. No, we had our liberty taken away for a month. We had a lot of carrots on board. <laughs> Recognize someone? No. I thought I did, but no. But when am I finally going to meet that partner of yours? Drake? Well, that's ex-partner. Mm. Yeah, I've been flying solo for a while now. Drake's out. Oh. Like... Dead, Art? Oh, no. More like retired. Mm. Last I heard, he settled down, got married. Mm. Well, then he might as well be dead, right? <laughs> Victor Sullivan! How the hell are you? Rafe? How long has it been? Ten years? Twelve? Fifteen. <laughs> it's amazing. All these years gone by, here we are, we're still haggling over dead people's junk. <laughs> really? Aren't you running your parents' business? My business now. But yes, that is my day job. Oh, <laughs> that is one hell of a day job. You could probably afford to buy up everything on the block tonight. Well, sure. But what would be the point in that? And these days, I'm only looking for the good stuff. Big scores. Any advice on what I should pick up tonight? <laughs> yeah. I think I want to bid against him. <laughs> but, um... <clears throat> Just between you and me, I did notice they changed the order. Hmm. I think somebody might be trying to rig this auction. Hmm. Well, remember where we are. This crowd didn't get rich by playing fair. Which is why you really need someone watching your back in a place like this. Ah. Well, I do hate to break it to you. You are working for an American. With? We've partnered up on this one. I see. <laughs> Talk about a power couple. In a few moments, we'll begin bidding on our next item, an inlaid wooden crucifix from the Trotty State. Well, I know when I'm a third wheel, you two kids have fun tonight. Just hold on, Sully. How'd you find out about it? It? What it is that, Rafe? Nadine, I think your partner here has had too many bloody marriages. Cut the bullshit, old man. I don't know how you scammed your way in here, but if you think about bidding on Avery's cross, I can tell you exactly how you're going to be leaving in a goddamn Rafe. fight. <laughs> well, you get my point. Lovely seeing you both. Nate? Nate? Damn it, kid, where the hell are you? Okay. Power room. I can do this.
Which way? God, why did I pick the power room? abbastanza se dobbiamo fare anche gli elettri eh, vuoi dire di no ecco fatto oh. speriamo di non dover cambiare altri fusibili del cazzo stasera direi che per stasera può bastare ma che diavolo pronto Here we go. Now, where the hell are the circuit breakers? Ah, crap. Sam, Sully, you there? God damn it, kid. Where the hell have you been? I made it. Had a few close calls, but... Yeah, well, if you're gonna cut the power, now would be a good time. Right, well, I'm gonna need a minute before I can reach the panel. We don't have a minute. Rafe's about to walk out of here with your cross. Wait, what? Rafe? Rafe is here? Yes, Rafe is here, and as of right now, he has the highest bid. Well, I'll bid him. With what? I don't have that kind of scratch. Sully, we're stealing it, remember? What if he calls my bluff? <sighs> he won't. We have 90,000. Do I hear any more bids? Guys, if we do not get this cross, I am as good as dead. Yeah. Well, I end up with the highest bid. We're all dead. Sully, I need you to buy me more time. Since we have no other bids. Trust me. Going once. Going twice. Scott. Then we have 100,000 euros in the room. Thank you. Do we have any other bids? We now have 110,000 euros in the room. For a penny and for a pound. That bit brings Don't us worry. to 120. We'll be out of there in no time. I better be. Okay. Just gotta smash the lock. Now the bit has reached 130,000. Nope. We are now at 110. Nothing. Damn it. Your bit, signore, takes us all the way to 130,000 euros. Gotta be something. Come on. Man, uh, we're starting to sweat bullets here. Yeah, give me a sec. The bidding stands at 160,000 euros in the room. Signore's bid makes 170,000. Yes. We are now at 180,000 euros in the room. <laughs> gotcha. It's now reached 190,000 euros. All right, boys, I'm at the switch. You ready? As I'll ever be, Victor. Just a sec. The gentleman's bid, 200,000 euros. 500,000. Let's get the show on the road here. Uh, thank you. We have 500,000 euros in the room. Does the gentleman wish to bid again? <laughs> Had me worried there for a minute, Victor. Thought I might have to kill you. <laughs> okay, let's ruin this asshole's evening. Anyone else? We are going once. Going twice? Then I shall sell it for 500,000...
Ladies and gentlemen, please remain calm. The backup power will come on shortly. It's gone. Barrate tutti riuscite. Move it! Get out of the way! Stop him! Hey! Stop that guy! Fermo! What are you doing? You're letting him get away! You speak! Sparish. What? 